And back in December of 2013, John Mooney's committed a brutal crime and was charged with murder. But he took a plea deal to a reduced charge of manslaughter. When the family of the victim heard the sentence this morning, they were not very happy. WOWT 6 News' John Chapman was the only reporter in the courtroom. The victim's family walked out of the courtroom today angry over the sentence. He took a life and he should do life in prison, not 15, 20 years, no. The family of Delbert Fremont Jr. not happy with today's sentence. John Munez entered a no contest plea to a reduced charge of manslaughter. He has been convicted of killing Fremont, dismembering his body, and then throwing the parts in a ravine near the Douglas Washington County line. The family of the victim says 20 to 40 years is not good enough for such a horrible crime. I thought the sentence was not enough for what he did to my brother. Discarding my brother like a dog on a, on, a, on a, in a country road, he needs more time than that. He got out of the system while on probation. His probation didn't, he didn't keep up the probation, didn't check in. So if he gets out of here, so what makes him think they're going to keep, he's going to go through another loophole to do this to somebody else. So I feel that there was no justice done today. Because Munez is an habitual criminal, the first 10 years of his sentence will be served with no good time. That's still not enough for Fremont's family, because they say one day Munez will still walk away a free man. With photographer Mike Clues, John Chapman, WOWT 6 News. In court today, Munez still insists the killing was in self-defense. He did apologize to the family for the way he disposed of Freeman's body.